Hashtag Kim is a TikTok we who grew a platform around July 2019. Since then, she has skyrocketed to 1 mil followers on TikTok and 600,000 on Instagram. She is known for her being pretty and having a nice sense of style. No, her name is surrounded around controversy. Why? You ask? Well, recently she has changed her whole aesthetic and not for style or new interest. It seems like she did it for her BF. How does one go from this to this? Hum, what caused this change? Let's guess. Cue drum roll. Yes, it him. Hannah Kim's boyfriend. His name is Ned Jang. He began to grow on social media in 2020 and throughout 2021. He has 49.6 thousand followers on Instagram and 399.5 thousand on TikTok. In March this year, he got exposed for pedo behavior and cheating and lying. The Instagram page Cancel Ned Jang is still up and has all of the pins and information. He has talked to underage girls and knowing they are underage sent them inappropriate pictures and also assaulted and without consent takes videos of other girls and sending it randomly to people. He even fat shamed someone into an eating disorder. Don't believe me. Here are some of the deets. The rest are at Cancel Ned Jeng Instagram page. Look at the things he has done. There is way more detail at Cancel Ned Jeng Instagram page. He is absolutely horrific. This is disgusting and no one should have a platform at this rate, but he does unfortunately. But Hannah Kim brought more light to this controversy. Since she is dating Ned and recently seems to have changed for him, she is producing a feed that has very childlike gestures and actions nothing like how she used to post before. She went from an Instagram baddie to a kid-like aesthetic. I am not reaching since she changed when she began dating her boyfriend since middle of this year. She is paler, lost a bit of weight it seems, and also began to pose like a child yes a child. It's not just a simple aesthetic change. It seems like she is catering to her boyfriend p word sick fantasy. I think she has become this way due to her boyfriend liking cop children so she is trying to cater to him. It add up. Get with a p world boyfriend goes from baddie to a whole kid. To top it all off she even blocks anyone who talks about her boyfriend. So many creators have brought this to light but she would just dismiss them. Just this post is saying enough for me. I am sorry what come again. Professor what oh heck no. She doesn't care. After people are telling her about her boyfriend, she posted a picture of her boyfriend with jail beneath it. Likey that is clearly mocking the victims. Maybe an unpopular opinion but was if she is a victim. Her boyfriend can easily manipulate her and tell her everyone is lying and against him and he would never. She would easily believe him since she is with him. Who knows? He could have some control or manipulation over her. No, this is not me excusing her not caring about the victims and ignoring them and laughing about her boyfriend's BEH. With all the stuff he is being accused of, which is a list I would not be surprised if he was manipulating or controlling her behavior. He could be telling her dress and cat a certain way. Because she like him she changes for him which happens and has happened in relationships. Just a thought, not a fact. It's sad to see her change this way she was such a cool creator but now she is problematic. I never thought she would ever do this, but here we are. But one this is important w email stop and take down. Ned Jeng he is very problematic and does deserves to be held problematic. Hannah Kim girly if you see this wake up pots. Your boyfriend has issues and is gross and disgusting. Hopefully you guys can help raise awareness about Ned Jeng and call him out for his horrible behavior. 
Hannah needs to stop catering to her p-word boyfriend since that is encouraging his behavior and making it seem okay. As it not, it's gross. This is all I have to say now. Please comment below your opinions and no hate we can disagree or agree respectfully remember. Thank you have a nice day or night or afternoon.